Okay, this is for Leo. What messages do you have for Leo for the beginning of February? Messages for Leo. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. So it's funny because changes need to be made, but you're coming in in reverse. It's like, it's like you know you have a decision to make, but you're like, you're really mulling it over. You, you know, like there's too many options maybe to handle. Um, you're going to reluctantly move on, for sure. Like leaving a lot of emotions behind. Um, you're not going to like, like look back at this person, follow this person, uh, follow their social media, make phone calls, like look at their pictures that you're not going to do any of that. You're pulling your own card. I do feel like you're on your way to happiness. I'm going to be honest with you. There will be communication about your heartbreak, some pretty bitter communication about your heartbreak, but, um, I don't feel like you're like... You know how sometimes you sort of like twist the knife after a breakup or or during an argument with somebody, you know, whether it's a friend or a lover, like whatever, you just kind of like, um, you look back at their photos, you look back over texts. It's almost like you, like, you know, the drama of it or like the pain of it is like some somehow satisfying. I feel like you're not going to do that. Though I do feel like that's a Leo thing to do. <laughs> I do. You're pulling your own cards over and over again. I like this, actually, to be honest with you. Be careful with your spending. Seriously. Be careful with your spending. Your spending looks not good. Um, there will be a lot more options, but I feel like it's not... It's going to be purely sexually based. Um, you're, pulling, you're pulling other people, but you're pulling them with wands, and that's sort of just like flings. So, I mean, if that's what you're after, then congrats. Um, one of them would definitely have a child, I believe. Yes. Um, okay, so I will t give you this. If I look down the deck quite a way ways, there will be a wish fulfillment. Could be a an Aquarius, okay? If you give it time, okay? If you were to work on this one, you both come up as the king and the queen of wands. So that's a very passionate powerful couple maybe not long term though okay it depends you know right now it would be just be a passionate like both find each other incredibly attractive you know really enjoy each other's you know humor or whatnot so do i see that as a possibility yes i just don't see it coming anytime soon okay 